Greetings, everyone. Uh, so, okay, first, I have a poll on Twitter right now. It'll be up for the next five days as of 9.30 p.m. on uh, February 2nd, 2018. Uh, it'll be up for the next five days. Uh, M yeah, MGL TV poll is the hashtag if you want to try to find it. Uh, or is it just regular tag? I don't know. But that's the tag that you want to put in and search if you want to find the poll. If you're following me on Twitter, you can just go to my page and look it up. Whatever animal for Animal Crossing that you vote on, right? Your options are bat, possum, dolphin, and mole, right? What animal you would like to see be introduced as a new villager animal in Animal Crossing for the Switch? I will incorporate that animal into my dream, my my wish list for Animal Crossing on the Switch. Um, <clears throat> so that's why I'm having this poll. Now, in the event of a tie, this is where you should comment about the animal. So this way, whatever animal gets more comments, you know, it comes down to the poll. But if there is a tie and there's more comments for, say, the mole, right, then the mole will win because it had more comments about it. So make sure, you know, if everyone comments on their animal and just doesn't vote, that's going to be... I have a coin toss app on my phone, so that's what that'll come down to. So, <laughs> so, also, because I have 300 subscribers and I kind of want to take the risk, also use the tag on Twitter, right, ask MGLTV. By using this tag, you can ask me one question, and for my March update video, and make sure to at me for Twitter, um, my voice just cracked, uh, it's my underscore geek life if you want to, you know, get some extra attention. Make sure to do that so this way I can see, you know, that the questions are coming. I am going to look for the tag, obviously, for March, and then I will answer your questions. No questions about fake news, politics, religion, or anything that might be a little too personal. Um, if I think it's an ignorant or lewd question, I'm not going to answer it. So, I'm not going to give examples of what these questions are. If, you, if you're going to be ignorant, you're not going to get any attention from me. So, that having been said, so I am still working my way through Pokemon Ultra Sun. Um, <laughs> it's a little frustrating for me. Like, I'm enjoying bringing you my experience playing through this game. I am enjoying playing it and, you know, playing it with you guys. It's just normally when I get a new Pokemon game... I blow through it within the first week. I unlock everything and I enjoy it. I just immerse myself within the game and I don't have much of a social life. But working 50 plus hours each week, yeah. So, <clears throat> I am going to do Dreamtown tours. Just, if you give me your dream address, try to give me a town that you feel is going to be an entertaining show. If you have nothing going on in that town, if there's nothing going on in the town and someone else's, it doesn't matter. It comes down to entertainment. I want people to feel like they, the 20 minutes of their time that they invested in watching that video was worth it for them. I would prefer to not have you go, like, your town of town, right, where Mayor Mayor is. I don't want that video to get disliked because that's ultimately your content that I am showcasing for you. And you're going to want to show it to everyone, and then you see all those dislikes. That's more on you than it is on me, but it hurts me too. And some people will just dislike because, oh, it's an Animal Crossing game. I'm going to dislike it. Or, oh, I'm going to dislike it because they didn't do anything special. You know, not everyone has a glorious fairy tale, perfect, uh, themed town. But sometimes a town is just beautiful without having a theme. And that's perfectly fine, but if your house has nothing in it, you haven't gotten a single new villager yet, and no public works projects, and there's no flowers or trees because you cut them all down, no. So just keep that in mind before you start trying to become a superstar overnight for your dream town. Um, I do have a long list of them that I'm going to be going through. Um, like I said, if you want to give me your dream address, you're more than welcome to. I will put it in the list, and if it gets shown, it gets shown. If not, not. I mean, that's just the way the world works. Um, I'm kind of getting inspiration on how to do the videos from other YouTubers. It just because I want to make sure 
I represent your town properly. So let's talk about this demonetization thing. In other words, I'm getting demonetized on February 20th. Um, I don't really care to be honest. Uh, if the money I'm making off of Patreon is going towards getting me a gaming PC so I can make better videos. Um, Patreon is awesome. Even big name YouTubers use Patreon for their creations and make, you know, a lot more money. And if, and also Twitch, their subscribers, like, pay out a lot more money than, like, YouTube is free, but if you want to subscribe to someone on Twitch, that's going to be, you're paying money to them. So, you know, people are looking away from YouTube, and now YouTube's making it harder for people to become stars on their channel, but that's the fault of everyone who does something stupid, ignorant, hateful, or just plainly butt-headed puts it up on YouTube, and that's also the fault of everyone who watches those videos and has them go viral and puts them all over the place, and that makes YouTube look like it's a venue for fools. So that is why, in my opinion, YouTube is doing this, and I'm totally okay with it. Anyone who stops, you know, producing for their channel, anyone who shuts their channel down because they're not going to make what little bit of money they were probably making, like, not many people make money off of YouTube, I hate to say it, but it's true, then they weren't in it for their subscribers, they were just in it to make easy money and be lazy, and it is a lot of work, like, I have a crappy computer, like, it's good, I could play games on it, it's not crappy, but... I have a crappy computer. It takes it about 45 minutes to an hour to sometimes process a 15-20 minute video depending on how much editing I've done. It can take it quite a while to do anything. In fact, my episodes for Pokemon Sun, those 15 to 20, sometimes half hour long videos, it takes my computer, and keep in mind I do have DSL, but it takes my computer a good hour sometimes to upload videos. So that's why I try to upload in mass on the weekend when I have off, and then throughout the week I just work and come home and do whatever. Yeah, so, you know, keep that in mind before you, you know, praise someone for stupidity on YouTube. Keep in mind that you're hurting the people that aren't, you know, doing stupid stuff. So make sure to check out that poll over on Twitter. If you want to ask me a question, go ahead and do so. Um, all in all, all good things for the channel. I do have some ideas and some plans for some merchandise, so keep an ear out for that. I'll probably put it on Tumblr, because I love putting stuff on Tumblr. It is my favorite social media, other than Facebook and Twitter. But I gotta start using all my social media to get more attention, so... So thank you for watching. Make sure to hit those links below to follow me on social media. Make sure to give this video a like and check out those other videos from me in the right-hand column.